You want to know the happenings in Jamaica today? Good, I got them right here on Jamaica News Online. I am Esmer Sastin and welcome to Jamaica News Online. These are the latest headlines today. Jamaican urged to show care for mental illness and residents protest police shooting in Mount Pelier, Hanover. Details coming up right after this break. Are you tired of browsing all over the latest happenings in Jamaica? Discover it right here on Jamaica News Online TV YouTube channel foreigner home and you want to be in touch with the happenings in Jamaica, guess what? Hip news at 6 p.m. Ask and you shall receive guys. So if you are watching this video, like, subscribe, comment, or share, hit that subscribe button and remember to comment below with your thoughts. Guys, make sure you come back again and again to watch. Minister of Health and Wellness Dr. Christopher Tufton is calling on community members to show greater support and care for persons with mental health challenges. He argued that a more caring approach will break down the stigma and discrimination surrounding mental illness and encourage more persons to seek help when they need it and not feel fearful or ashamed. The minister, who was addressing the recent opening of a mental health conference at the AC Marriott Hotel in New Kingston, said it is important that persons in distress get assistance as soon as possible. As such, he said that every individual with appropriate levels of training and support can provide psychological support for people who show signs of a mental health problem. The conference, held under the theme Prioritizing Mental Health in the Workplace, discussed various topics including mentally healthy workplace, emotional intelligence in the workplace, bipolar disorder, missing and misdiagnosing adult ADHD, workplace accommodations for people with cognitive impairment and substance use disorder screening, and workplace wellness. Residents on Wednesday blocked the road with debris in protest over police fatal shooting. Chance for justice rang out from a section of the Montego Bay to Negril Main Road on Wednesday morning as residents protested against a police fatal shooting on the weekend. It's reported that about 1 p.m. last Saturday, 20-year-old Adidra Vidal, a resident of Hellgate in Montpelier, Hanover, was fatally shot during a confrontation with a police team in his community. A Glock pistol with a magazine containing five rounds was reportedly taken from him. But residents from Montpelier, who argued that the incident was unwarranted, are upset about the lack of information from the Independent Commission of Investigations and the police. A resident, Audrey Irwin, is among several people refuting the police's account of the incident. The woman who gave account of the incident said that the police came and knocked on the grill and the now deceased man came and opened the grill. Once he opened the grill, the police just pushed him in, pushed him into the room and just shot him. The police said that he drew a gun at them. She said he did not have a gun because if he did, he would not have opened the grill. She said a single explosion was heard after which the police dragged him out and put him into a jeep. Miss Irwin said Indicom visited the area on Saturday and had promised to return to survey CCTV footage, a commitment it has yet to fulfill. Deputy Superintendent Angela McIntosh Gale, who is in charge of operations in Hanover, sought to assure residents that the authorities are probing the matter. She also urged the angry residents to refrain from blocking the thoroughfare. Debris was set ablaze and several logs were spread across the road. DSP McIntosh Gale said, This is a breach of the law. 
a loss of life is not something that we glorify, but when it does happen, we take the necessary steps to ensure that justice is served. So whatever they deem justice to be, we are already embarking on that. And so we ask the community to desist from what they're doing because it is also a breach of the National Solid Waste Act and so persons can be charged. But as not to stir up any problem now, we are aware of who are involved, but we are dealing with it at a different point, she said. Guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment down below.